This mahogany desk is one of the most important writing desks in the history of the English language. For this once belonged to Charles Dickens, and it was here on this sloped writing surface that he penned some of his greatest works, Great Expectations, Hard Times, A Tale of Two Cities, and he even left his mark on the object. We know that Dickens was right-handed because of pictures of him, but we know from this object because of the wear on the desk. Look, it's more worn on the right-hand side. And the most highly worn draw knobs are also on the right. There are also oil marks from hands opening and closing the drawers. He also had this fruitwood chair which stands on casters, that's the little wheels, so I suppose he could whiz around the room as he was thinking. And after Dickens' death, this desk was often shown in depictions of the great writer at work, like this one, Dickens' Dream. And it now stands in the Charles Dickens Museum, his home in Dowsey Street in London.